This is a video introduction for the new Thornycroft TK series marine engine range. This particular model is the TK50, 50 horsepower at 2600 rpm, fitted with a PRM 150D2 hydraulic gearbox, 2 to 1 reduction on this particular model. Heat exchanger cooled. This unit is built to commercial workboat specifications, so wider mounting brackets and a larger flywheel and flywheel housing. This unit's also been specified with the deluxe dash panel with video instrumentation. Set of anti-vibration mounts and a four meter extension harness with waterproof connectors. Oil filter mounted low on the front corner. Fuel filter housing with a manual priming bulb. Air filter with a replaceable paper element. Seawater pump for 25 millimeter intake hose. Oil extraction pump. Stainless steel water-cooled exhaust injection bend for 50 millimetre hose. This particular unit is fitted with a single 75 amp alternator. There is the option to fit a second alternator. Likewise, there is an option for a power takeoff drive shaft to be mounted to the front crank pulley, as well as an option for a deck wash pump or indeed to relocate the seawater pump from its gear driven side mounting onto a belt driven front mounting at which point it would sit in this location here. Assembled and marinized in the UK two point two litre base engine on the TK fifty TK40 is based on a similar block but with a different fuel injection pump to produce 43 horsepower for the TK40 as well as the TK60 which is based on a 2.4 litre block. In addition to the PRM150 there is the option of a range of alternative transmissions. Uh, PRM280 centerline, uh, the 260 drop centre and if down angle gearbox is required we can offer the Technodrive TM345A. All of these are carried in stock. All the hoses were bespoke moulded for this particular build as you will see the end covers for the gearbox oil cooler are fully integral to the hose to minimize hose joints and potential points of failure. Except for at the extreme end, all the wiring harness is fully sheathed and shrouded. with the wiring loom connector terminating down here. There are two oil fill points. One is here, the other is on top of the rocker cover here. Obviously coolant fill point in the top of the heat exchanger. There is the option to fit hot water takeoffs for calorifier. There are two control panel options. This particular panel is the deluxe model 
the standard model features the same tachometer with hour counter, key switch and warning light cluster but does not have the voltmeter, temperature gauge or oil pressure gauge. Wiring extension looms are available in lengths of 4 meters or 8 meters, depending on the requirement. Electrics on these engine are 12 volt as standard, although 24 volt is available for bespoke orders. If you would like any further information, please visit our website www.thornycroftengines.com